my Macy first year. Firstly, I want to wish you a very happy Independence Day. We all are gathered over here to celebrate our 73rd Independence Day. I feel proud to be an Indian. We are able to breathe the fresh, free air since our birth. If at all we want to know the pangs of agony of being slaves under a foreign rule, we must ask our elders born before 1947. It was indeed a Himalayan task for every Indian those days to fight against those powerful giants, the British rulers. We must not allow those hard times and struggles fade away from our memories. Hence, it is benefiting for us to celebrate such national festivals and recall those heroic deeds of our national heroes. We must remember them today, right from Mahatma Gandhi to the local patriotic leaders. We owe our gratitude when we regard those martyrs who laid their precious life for our sake. We must not ignore the common people who sacrificed. who sacrificed their lord for the good cause there were farmers landlords businessmen teachers writers and poets and students who helped the land achieve the long cherished freedom today we have come a, a long way in the path of free india we have proved ourselves worthy of freedom we are considered as the largest democracy in the world How proud we were when Abhinav Bindra made our national flag flutter and Janagana Mana played at the background in Beijing. We are proud of it and feel very happy about all these positive aspects. But are we blind to black clouds surrounding us? Are we very successful in using our freedom in the right manner? If so, why should there be so many bomb blasts, killings, attacks on government offices, causes against so many politicians and so many unstable governments? Well, my dear friends, what can a student do at this juncture? Should we go and court the terrorists? Should we fight against the corrupted politicians, or should we take our the country into hands of waving other war by freedom? Now we are not expected to do all these things. We must keep observing things around us. We will have our own day. Before that, let us do our duty of preparing ourselves to be well-educated citizens of tomorrow. Let us do our duty sincerely and study hard to achieve a goal. Today, we require youngsters with lot of knowledge and energy. Literacy is the first enemy for a democratic nation. Let us get rid of illiteracy and take India to a bright future. Thank you. Have a great day.